Run the code online or download from codegive.com, link in the description below. Downgrading Python from version 3.9 to 3.7 can be necessary in certain cases, especially if you're working on a project that requires compatibility with an older version of Python. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to safely downgrade Python on different operating systems, along with code examples where applicable. Before starting the downgrade process, it's essential to check the current version of Python installed on your system. Open a terminal or command prompt and type the following command. This command will display the currently installed Python version. If it's Python 3.9, then proceed with the downgrade process. The next step is to uninstall Python 3.9 from your system. The method for uninstallation varies depending on your operating system. Now, it's time to install Python 3.7 on your system. You can download the installer from the official Python website, https colon slash slash www.python.org slash download slash release slash python hyphen 370 many mac os and linux distributions come with python 3.7 pre-installed if not you can use your package manager to install python 3.7 for example on ubuntu after installing python 3.7 Verify that the installation was successful by checking the Python version. This command should display the Python 3.7 version number. If you had packages installed using pip in Python 3.9, you might need to reinstall them for Python 3.7 compatibility. You can update pip to the latest version using the following command. Finally, Test your Python 3.7 installation by running a simple Python script or opening an interactive Python shell. This will open the Python 3.7 interactive shell, where you can execute Python code. By following these steps, you should be able to safely downgrade Python from version 3.9 to 3.7 on your system. Remember to update any environment variables or settings that might be affected by the change in Python versions, especially if you're using virtual environments or IDEs. ChatGPT Downgrading Python from version 3.9 to 3.7 involves a few steps to ensure a smooth transition. Before you begin, it's essential to understand the potential risks and compatibility issues associated with downgrading. Make sure to back up your projects and virtual environments before proceeding. Additionally, be aware that some packages may not be compatible with older Python versions. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to downgrade Python 3.9 to 3.7, including code examples. Before making any changes, it's crucial to back up your current environment, including your projects and virtual environments. Use the following command to uninstall Python 3.9. Replace Python 3.9 with Python 3 or Python if you're using a different alias. Next, install Python 3.7 using the package manager. For example, on Ubuntu, you can use the following commands. If you want to set Python 3.7 as the default version, you may need to update the alternatives and select the new version. Choose the number corresponding to Python 3.7. If you use virtual environments, recreate them with the desired Python version. Navigate to your project directory and create a virtual environment. Activate the virtual environment. After activating your virtual environment, install the required dependencies using pip. Replace requirements.txt with the actual name of your requirements file. Ensure that your project runs correctly with Python 3.7. If there are any compatibility issues, you might need to update your code or dependencies accordingly. This tutorial provides a general guide, and the commands might vary depending on your operating system and package manager. Adjust the commands accordingly based on your specific environment. 
ChatGPT. Downgrading Python from version 3.9 to 3.7 might be necessary for compatibility reasons with certain libraries or projects. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do it on a typical Unix-based system, like Linux or Mac OS. Keep in mind that this process might vary slightly depending on your operating system and package manager. Before downgrading, make sure you have Python 3.7 installed on your system. Open a terminal and type. This command will show you the currently installed Python 3.7 version. If you don't have Python 3.7 installed, you will need to install it first. You can find installation instructions for your specific operating system online. To downgrade, you'll need to uninstall Python 3.9 first. Use the package manager that was used to install Python 3.9. For example, if you used apt on Ubuntu, you can uninstall Python 3.9 with Replace apt with your package manager's name if you're using a different system. Now, you can install Python 3.7. Again, use your package manager. For example, using apt on Ubuntu. After installation, verify that Python 3.7 is installed correctly. This command should display the newly installed Python 3.7 version. If you were using Python 3.9 within virtual environments, you might need to recreate those environments with Python 3.7. Activate your virtual environment and recreate it with Python 3.7. Or if you're using Venv, built in in Python 3.7 plus. If your system relies on the Python 3 command to invoke Python 3, you may need to update the symbolic link to point to Python 3.7 instead of Python 3.9. This step varies based on your operating system and setup. You have successfully downgraded Python from version 3.9 to 3.7. Remember to test your applications and scripts to ensure compatibility with Python 3.7. Additionally, be cautious when uninstalling Python versions, as some system tools or applications may depend on specific versions. Always verify the impact before removing any Python installation. ChatGPT Downgrading Python from version 3.9 to 3.7 can be necessary for compatibility reasons with certain libraries or applications that haven't been updated to support the latest Python version. In this tutorial, I'll guide you through the process of downgrading Python on a typical Unix-like system, such as Linux or Mac OS. The process might vary slightly depending on your operating system and setup. Step 1, Check Current Python Version Before you begin, verify the current version of Python installed on your system. Open a terminal and type. This command will display the currently installed Python version. If it's Python 3.9, proceed with the downgrade. Step 2, Install Python 3.7 If Python 3.7 isn't already installed on your system, you'll need to install it. You can typically use your package manager to install older versions of Python. For example, on Ubuntu, you can use apt. Follow the prompts to complete the installation. Once installed, verify the installation by running. This command should display the Python 3.7 version. Step 3, install pip for Python 3.7. If you're planning to use pip with Python 3.7, you might need to install it separately. To do this, use the get-pip.py script. This will install pip for Python 3.7. You can verify the installation by running. Step 4, set Python 3.7 as the default. If you want to make Python 3.7 your default Python version, you'll need to update the symbolic link pointing to the Python executable. Be cautious with this step, as it might affect other applications relying on Python 
This command updates the symbolic link slash usr slash bin slash python 3 to point to slash usr slash bin slash python 3.7. Step 5, Verify Default Python Version. Check if the default Python version has been updated. It should now display the Python 3.7 version. You have successfully downgraded Python from version 3.9 to 3.7 on your system. Remember to be cautious when altering system configurations, and always verify changes to avoid unintended consequences. Chat GPT Downgrading Python from version 3.9 to 3.7 involves uninstalling the current Python version and then installing the desired version. Below is a step-by-step -step tutorial with code examples for each step. Make sure to follow these instructions carefully. Before starting the downgrade process, check your current Python version using the following command in the terminal or command prompt. Uninstall the existing Python 3.9 installation. Open the terminal or command prompt and run the following commands. This will remove Python 3.9 from your system. Next, download and install Python 3.7. You can use the official Python website or a package manager like PyEnv or Conda. Here, we'll use the official website. Visit the Python 3.7 download page and download the installer for your operating system. Run the installer, making sure to check the box that says Add Python 3.7 to Path during the installation process. After the installation is complete, Verify that Python 3.7 has been installed successfully by running. To avoid conflicts with other Python projects or system dependencies, it's good practice to create a virtual environment. Navigate to your project directory in the terminal and run.